you for tuning in. If this is the first time that we're connecting, my name is Carlos Vargas, and it's a pleasure that you're here with us. And if this is the first time that we're here for a reason, this. So you can bring some music into your feed. And one of the most requested features in one of the sessions yesterday, and it was different from the second day with this feed, but this works for any online streaming platform. So if you're using VLive, if you're using uh, StreamYard, this will help you. And I have done a couple of this for you. Let me see here. Tell me a little bit of So, here's one of the things. Music is something, let me pause it here before I can it up. So, music is something that has copyright. If you don't own it, you cannot legally stream it. And with the things that uh, Facebook is doing lately, it actually gonna give you problems. They will cut your stream, they will tag. If you do it on YouTube and you get three strike, your channel get um, re, uh, canceled. So how can we do that? Here is an alternative for you. There's a couple of them. Today I'm gonna be talking about some guys called Stream Beats. So let me bring them up in here. So streambeats.com, streambeats.com allow you to have free music for your stream. So let me bring it up a little bit bigger so you can see it. So one of the cool things that they have, they have been on the internet for a long time. And how does it work? You can use the music and add it to your streams without problem. So don't worry. I'm gonna tell you how you can do this. And here's a cool thing. You can download the music to your computer and you can use it in any platform. Even if you want to have uh, the license, they will give you a license. So all that you have to do is you click this icon here and you're gonna download it. When I tell you that there's music, I downloaded close to 20 gigabytes, literally 20 gigabytes of music that you actually can stream and leverage with anything that you do. So then the question becomes, let me go here. How do you use it? What do you do? So I'm gonna give you the easiest way that you can add to your streams. And you don't need to be a programmer. You don't need to be a streaming genius. All that you have to use, and this one is specifically focused on PC. Let me bring it up in here. So this is a software called SoundPad. It costs, I think it's $5. Five, nothing else, five. And what this software does is that it integrates the music that you put on this on a playlist with your microphone. So again, all that you have to do is, look, I'm gonna pick this song in here. And right now, you're hearing it on the stream. And that will allow you to then get music. You can play with the levels, with the settings and everything. And Thing about it is that I can create this list and have multiple. Of them. So, in a simple way, you can now add. Let me just go side by side so you can see. It. So, we can have, let's see, right there, you see, right there is a playlist. Right here is me. Playlist, me. Playlist, me. Okay. So, you can actually have it as you are doing your stream. You can then control the volume on Windows. And let me show you here. And again, I will do another one for my Mac friends. But when you go to your sound settings, let me bring this up again. What you're gonna see after you install it is that you go to the advanced volume preferences. 
and you're gonna see here sound pad. So you can decide how high the volume is for the music or how low and the microphone. So what this does is that it uses the same channel in the computer so you can send your music without a problem. So let's bring the party over. You can switch your music. And the idea is that you can have a little bit of something different for your stream so you can be unique. So my friends, it's been awesome to have you here. This is a quick video of how to add music for your stream. I hope that you like it. Make sure that you subscribe, you click the bell so you can get notified when we release new videos. And we'll see you on my next episode.